What's up guys, today let's take a look at how to transition from side control to the mount position without getting your foot caught into the three quarter mount. So let's take a look at Tainan Dalpra's no gi debut. He already passed his opponent's guard, he has a nice cross face here. His head is underneath his opponent's armpit, blocking the arm, serving as an underhook, maybe also trying to set up an arm triangle there, but eventually he's gonna get his arm there underneath his opponent's arm. He's trying putting up, he's trying to drive that shin all the way across his opponent's belly to secure the mount. His opponent is already facing away with his knees pointing away, trying to catch Tainan's ankle here into the three-quarter mount. You have to be very aware when your opponent is already facing away, you know that he's trying to catch your foot and drag into the three-quarter mount. So make sure you do a good job here. We're going to take a look at some of the details here. Tainan keeps tripoding up, eventually he's gonna drive his knee all the way here down to the ground next to his opponent's hip. He already transitioned his head, he's not trapping his opponent's arm with his head anymore. He got his underhook, and very very important, anytime that you're trying to transition into the mount from side control, make sure that you open your opponent's arm all the way up, okay, in order to kill his arm. So he cannot block your knee here with his hand, keeping your knee low. So when you step your foot to the mount, he catches your foot with his far leg here into the three-quarter mount. So Tainan here is doing a great job. He's stretching his opponent's arm all the way up. He has his shin flushed against his opponent's belly, setting up the mount. He has the nice cross face there, but his opponent does also a good job. Last resort defense here, trying to trap Tainan's ankle here against his own butt by pushing his knee against Tainan's ankle. So Tainan's foot is trapped there, he cannot free right now. If his opponent wasn't trapping his foot, of course, all he had to do was move, instead of dropping the foot to the ground here and maybe allowing his opponent to catch that foot, is moving instead, move the knee all the way up first and then you replace your foot where your knee is, right? That's why it's important to open up the underhook here. Open your opponent's arm all the way up so you have this big gap here to bring your knee all the way up underneath your opponent's armpit and just replace your foot with your knee here. That would be the ideal move if his opponent wasn't trapping Tainan's foot. So since Tainan cannot move his knee all the way up, he's gonna have to drop his foot here first. Paying attention that he doesn't, first he doesn't drop his foot in between his opponent's leg and second, if he clears his opponent's leg, dropping the foot here past above his opponent's knee, which of course he's, that's what he's gonna do, he still has to make sure that his opponent doesn't use this foot here to drag his ankle, drag his foot in between his legs, and now he's caught into the three-quarter mount. So what Tainan is gonna do is trap his opponent's leg here. He's gonna windshield wipe and hook his opponent's leg with this foot here. This foot's gonna hook his opponent's leg, preventing or restricting the ankle drag here so now he can take full mount position. Take a look there. As he prepares the mount, he's gonna hook, he's gonna windshield wiper his other foot, replacing his foot here, blocking his opponent's leg, hooking that leg, so he can safely drop his foot to the ground here, above his opponent's leg, right above his opponent's knee, landing flushed against the mat. As his opponent tries to drag his ankle, find his ankle here, that foot that he just windshield wiped is gonna block his opponent's leg here from ankle dragging. And then Kainan has all the space here to bring his knee all the way up underneath his opponent's armpit. Let's take a look there. As the opponent tries to drag his leg, it fails because of Tainan's hook there. He moves his leg up, knee all the way under his armpit, replacing the knee with his foot. And we can see here Tainan's hook blocking his opponent's leg, restricting the movement as we talked before. Great technique by Taina, great timing as well and recognition of the danger there. Now securing the full clean mount.